What's up, everybody? I am Sister Slayage, and welcome to my channel, Boo Sugars. If you are new here, welcome to the squad. Do not leave this junk without subscribing and becoming a member of the family around here. Show the nation some appreciation. Now, if you are already a member of the Slay Nation, welcome back, family. Go ahead on and like. And hit that notification bell if you haven't already. Today, we're going to be doing some last impressions. Yeah, I said it right. Last impressions, not first impressions. I know we see a lot of videos on YouTube about first impressions. You look at, oh my God, it's my first time opening. Oh my God, it's so beautiful and pigmented. Nah, 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 I ain't worried about all that. I want to talk about the last impressions. So these products are going to be products that have already been out on the market. And I'm going to present to you an empty container of the product because I done used it up. I done tried it. I done given it a chance to work. And I'm going to let you know my last impression of these products and if it's worth your money and if I would rebuy it. So, if you want to know about the lasting impression of the MAC Lightful C Softening Lotion, stay tuned. Well, since you're still here, I guess you want to know my last impressions on this MAC Softening Lotion. All right, it's going to get straight to it. All right, the MAC Softening Lotion, it retails for $36. It can be found online at maccosmetics.com or any retailer that sells MAC Cosmetics. So it could be Bloomingdale's, Macy's, Dealers United. If they sell MAC, they got that right here. And the Lightful C Softening Formula, it is a softening lotion, but it is in a liquid form. It comes with this little spray pump. As you well, it's not going to spray anything out because... Uh, I hope not. It's not going to spray anything out because this is empty. I have used all this product up. Um, and you want to you use this, you want to kind of hold it away from the face because you hit you in the face. Kind of put you in the mouth of a Fix Plus bottle. It smells really good. And the cool thing about this particular product, if you have foundation and your foundation doesn't have that nice radiant glow, Try putting this on before your primer and I guarantee you will see a world of difference. It dries down to like a tacky finish, so it does help the foundation cling to the skin. Um, you can also just use it by itself. So if you wash and uh, tone your face, spray this on before you moisturize or put your mask on and this product will work wonders. It does have vitamin C in it. And it does have the coral grass in it, which will help balance out your skin, any type of redness or irritation or um, hyperpigmentation. This product is really good when it comes to balancing the skin out. I have seen like tremendous changes in my skin with this particular product. I did not use it every day, hence it took me six months to use the product up. But if you use this every day, you probably had this product for like 60 days. A little goes a long way. You can take two spritz to the face and kind of rub it in, and that would be enough. If you do use this every day, I recommend you use it twice, once in the morning and once in the evening. I would say I start to see results with my skin with this product, I would say probably like a month of using it. That's when I start to see results with my skin and it's being more balanced. Now, when it came to results with my foundation, I saw results instantly. The skin would have such a nice glow, soft, it plumpens the skin. I mean, if you want the first step to glass skin, this is it. Like, and I'm not saying it because I like this product because I worked there or nothing like that. No, this is what it is. Like, even if I never worked at MAC, I would swear by this product. So, when it comes to a lasting impression, I would rebuy this product. All right, it's worth all 36 of them things. And also, make sure when you do buy this, hold on to the container. It does count as an empty for back to Mac. But yes, so was this product worth my money? It definitely was. Will I rebuy it? I definitely will. And what is my last impression of it? <laughs> Marvelous. So if y'all have any other questions about this particular product, the softening lotion by MAC Lightful C, go ahead and get in them comments. And also, if there are other products that you would like for me to do a lasting impressions about, put it in the comments as well. I'm going to have plenty to come. And it's not just going to be cosmetic. It's going to be other stuff too. I'm reviewing. I'm, I'm snitching. I'm reviewing. I'm telling my opinion about everything. Because I want you to be a way better, more economical shopper than I was. You know, I got stuff I done bought that I probably never should have bought and would never buy again. But this one is totally worth the money. So go ahead, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. 
and join the family if you haven't already. And also, if y'all want to look, you know, want this look right here, go ahead and hit that tutorial down there in the description box. I'm going to put that link up for this as well, you know what I'm saying? Got a little glitter galaxy. My last coming off, so guess we got all that. But yes, thank you for watching, and I love y'all, and y'all have a good one. Bye, Boo Sugars.